before I start this video, I did this on my FTM Transassic video because I always decide to talk about something very important at the end and not everybody watches the end of the video, therefore I will talk about it right now. My lover and I want to do a Q&A video because we have been receiving many questions um, from people and therefore we want to make a video about it. So if you have any questions for my lover and I, please put them down there in my crotch. I will fish them out, that's disgusting, and we will answer them in a video. Also, warning on this video, it's like trigger warning 101, this shit's so depressing it's not even funny. I just film, finished filming it and I really don't even want to post it, but you know what? It's about me not passing anymore and I like cry in the video. So here it is. Good luck. Hey guys, so I want to apologize. I'm sorry that I haven't posted in a month, but I did tell you guys that school is going to be crazy town, so yeah. This is actually going to be a topic that I wasn't planning on talking about. I really didn't feel like I needed to talk about this, but you know what? I have to talk about it, and I'm I'm very, very sorry for the way I'm talking right now. I'm so beyond tired. School life is crazy. Anyway, what I'm going to be talking about is I don't pass anymore. Now, you guys have watched me. I have how many subscribers? You all watch me. you see my face before. You know that this is, like, who I am. This is how I am. This is my face. You're used to this face. You can't really judge if I pass or not because you just have this image of me, right? Well, people who don't know me don't have this image. Honestly, it's messing with my head. Um, I am freaking out inside. I don't pass anymore. Even my sign language teacher, uh, we were in class and there was like two guys on the other side of the room and then there was like all girls on one side and then there was me and then she's like, finally two boys in the class. But there's like, she counted me as one of the women, which made me feel great because we had a conversation last semester about my identity in front of class and I explained transgender and stuff like that. It was great. I mean, like, how do you think that makes me feel? It makes me feel like, like, shit. Like, I am, like, like, I even, like, I don't feel like my, my identity is validated anymore, which sucks. Like, it makes me feel like shit. Obviously, that's not the only instance. On the phone, I have people call me ma'am. Like, you guys have seen my videos, though. Like, I talk about this all the time. I get a lot of, like, ma'am, and I get sheet a lot, which is, like, 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 whatever, whatever. I just let them believe what they want to believe. But when it comes to the point where I keep telling this person, like, I am not a lady, stop calling me a lady, and then they still call me ma'am, like, I know that your voice doesn't change or anything when you go off of tea, but is there something with my voice? Like, I honestly feel like I need to have a more manly voice. Like, the fact that I can't pass anymore is making me go crazy. And I know I was supposed to do, like, a gender career video and stuff like that, but I honestly feel like my identity, I can't do it anymore because of how I feel. I felt like it would be fine if I didn't pass anymore, but it's affecting me so much. Like, it's not just the fact that I don't pass at these places, it's just, it's it's just everywhere around me. Like, I live with my dad again, like, we, we I, you guys know I moved back, and, like, while I was making this video, like, I had to pause it because one of my stepmom's friends comes in, and then she just goes off and says, like, oh, is, and my birth name here, like, Dude, you've known I'm trans for the last four years. You know I've told you so many times to stop using that name and you just say no. Like, I can't take, I feel like I'm like getting so much hate right now from people who don't even know me and from people who know me and like, I get that my dad still uses my name and stuff like that, but like, I cut my hair this week and he, I was, he's like, oh, don't cut it too short. Like, I just like, I can't handle this like, this view of a girl that is associated with me and I hate that. I hate that I can't just be okay with people seeing me as a girl or a woman. Honestly, like I, I, I don't want to identify as male and have male privilege and go around this world with male privilege, but I do. And I don't want that. I don't, I want to be able to just be okay. But you know what? Male privilege is fucking on me and it's fucking tattooed to my forehead and I have to deal with it. It's just like, I don't want to detransition. I actually, I can't. I mean, I can do whatever I want, but the situation I'm in right now, I can't. And I don't, I just, I don't know how to explain how I feel right now. So what's going to happen with my life? I don't pass anymore. I can either go back on T and just go the easy way. That's the easy way for me because then I'll just start passing again. And, and then I'll just be fucking depressed. I'll be depressed because of my hair. I'll be depressed because of the acne. I'll be depressed because of the weight I'm going to start gaining again, which... I just, the second way to go is just deal with it. Deal with being misgendered all the time. Tell people, correct them, which I've had to do so many times this week. It's like the best week of my life. Where I have to just deal with 
like not fitting the binary which I really don't want to fit into but people automatically categorizing me as a woman and there's nothing wrong with that I just I don't know how to explain it honestly there's a feeling I have inside me right now and it's just making me want to scream and just cry and yell and just rip my fucking face off like I don't know how to explain it look I don't pass it's making me feel like shit I want to pass it's not my goal in life to pass but passing makes me feel comfortable but I would like I, it's not the fact that people see me as gay because I'm all flamboyant and shit like that Honestly, it's just a feeling I have inside that I don't know how to express. I don't know how to explain how I feel. It's making me so angry that people see me as a woman. Even those people in the street who like ask you for donations, like people who work for corporations, they were like, how are you two girls, ladies, doing today? Like, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't handle it. I want to be able to handle it. I want to be able to be okay with being misgendered and being called cheat. And maybe I can just like finally be okay with just, just fuck off with testosterone and this man power dominating over my life and just being okay with being me and you know being seen as a woman is okay i want to it's not that women are seen as less lesser people in society that i don't want to look like a woman hell no that is like no feminist over here no that is not my point i want to be seen as a woman but i want to be to have male pronouns does that even fucking make sense no i fucking can't handle my life anymore I'm so sick of this confusion. I'm sick of being in the middle. I don't want, like, in the middle of not knowing my thoughts. I love being in the middle. It makes me happy. I don't want to be seen as completely woman. I don't want to be seen as completely man. Because if I'm seen as completely man, then I am seen as a transsexual male who's all fucking dominating and shit. And I don't want that. <sighs> I'm going to get so much shit for making this fucking video. I can fucking feel it right now. Obviously, this week has not been the best. <laughs> and I'm sorry that I'm putting this video online. But you know what? I don't pass and I feel like people need to see this. I know that a lot of people who watch my videos are not on Tia and they don't pass. I was there once and it sucked. But this is beyond because I passed for over a year and now I suddenly don't. It's like my identity doesn't exist anymore. I feel like I'm being like dehumanized by society. Anyways, passionate video. I had to stop this video like six times to cry, but anyways, hope you guys have a great week. Um, I semester is almost over. I will be discussing further things with you guys about my identity. If I ever fucking figure it out, if I ever go back on tea or anything. Also, um, a little top surgery update. I've actually decided to postpone it. It was causing me even more pain to think about having top surgery than this is, which can, can you even imagine how much stress I had in my life when I was thinking about that? Um, my body is ready for surgery. My emotions are not. My brain is not ready for surgery. If I wake up one day and look down and I don't have tits, I'm going to freak out. Freak out. I can't do it. Basically, this video is so serious right now, I can't even handle it. Usually I'm all like funny and transition is so funny, but like fuck life right now. Okay, I was swearing so much, like this video is going to have one of those like, you can't watch it unless you're 18, which goes like half my viewers. <laughs> Yes, I put some comedy in this video so it's not so fucking serious. Fuck it, I'll just deal with life. I can't, I have so much anxiety thinking about that. This is not a good week to talk about this. Anyways, check out my FTM Transastic videos. When school is over, I will be updating very soon. If you have any topics you would like me to discuss, please put them in. Alright, I hope you have a great week. I will see you soon.